What's going on? I am the mass man. Mr. Mass Man, Mr. Mass Man, the Mass Man, whatever you want to call it. <clears throat> now, there's this story that's been going around in the media. Um, ASAP Rocky and Rihanna. ASAP Rocky and Rihanna. It's been um, a popular story that people feel like ASAP Rocky is somehow being emasculated by Rihanna because of the photo that he took where he's holding the baby and Rihanna's out in front. And a lot of dudes have a whole lot of consternation and irritation with ASAP. They feel like he shouldn't have taken the photo. They feel like he's some sort of a beta male that he isn't you know he isn't running the relationship he isn't he isn't the man in the relationship <clears throat> what I have to say to that to those people who have a problem with ASAP Rocky is, you motherfuckers are stupid. You, you, you motherfuckers are stupid. You're stupid. I, I'm, I'm just, I'm just not here for the bullshit that the world throws out. It, it irritates me. It, it annoys me. It, it gives me. It, it, it gives me um, feelings of rage. Look, my manhood is not where it needs to be. I got to get my own house in order in terms of being a man, looking at myself as a man, and and all of that. I got work to do. I got work to do. I'm, I'm not where I need to be. But ASAP Rocky, if Rihanna, if Rihanna left him today, he would be fine. ASAP Rocky is, a, is, is, is to, to the best of my knowledge, he's a millionaire or he, you know, claims or he appears to be a guy who can take care of himself. He he seems like a guy who's got some kind of hustle. He's got some kind of get up and go. He seems like if Rihanna left him tomorrow, he would be fine. But niggas, there is nothing, nothing that ASAP Rocky could ever do that would make him Rihanna's financial equal. There's nothing that ASAP Rocky could ever do that would make him the that would make him the financial equal of Rihanna. That bitch is on another planet. She's on another planet. She is a billionaire. There's how many billionaires in hip hop? How many hip hop billionaires are there? Kanye was a fake billionaire. His whole thing was in contracts and deals jay-z maybe he's a billionaire but let's be real beyonce probably makes more than that nigga does too but that's not the issue you all of you it's like this is this video isn't about asap rocky this video is about is about dudes men talking shit like Men have this idea that if you're a man, just because of your manness, just because you got nuts, you're supposed to run shit. That you're supposed to run shit just because you got a sack with some nuts in between your legs. You're supposed to run the household. You're supposed to be running shit. You're supposed to... I heard, I heard 
I, like one, there's a nigga who talks a lot. He's a comedian. He says that my wife has a say, but my decision is final. Like, I got the final say. I got the final say. Like, what what qualifies you niggas to have the final say? What what what? How are you niggas qualified to have the last say? To have the final word? What what qualities do you possess that gives you the discernment to always and forever just because you got a dick to make so the final say? You 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 niggas ain't making no sense. You niggas ain't making no sense. And you got a problem with ASAP Rocky because he's letting his bitch shine. That's what you're supposed to do. If you're the man, you just sit back and you handle your business. You handle business. You take care of what needs to be taken care of and let the bitch look great. He's letting his bitch look great. Don't Rihanna look great in the picture, standing up there looking all special? Don't she look great? That's what you're supposed to do. Your bitch supposed to look great and you supposed to look however you look. You supposed to look however you look is all right because I'm a man. I can take it. I can handle it. I'm, I'm, she bringing home me the money. You niggas don't get that. You niggas don't get that she, that she got two, she got one, one and a half babies with this nigga and this nigga has been there and he ain't going nowhere and she going to take the money to their household and it's their money even though they're not legally married. It's like, don't you motherfuckers don't see that? That, the, that these two are a unit, that this is a business arrangement, that this is a that this is some kind of family. You niggas just want a nigga to be up front dancing and shucking and jiving for your entertainment so that you can congratulate them. You ain't shit. And I got a problem with y'all having a problem because cause cause this ain't this ain't the issue. This ain't the first thing. Niggas been having a problem with ASAP Rocky. Niggas been having a problem because they thinking that he ain't doing enough. What that what the fuck can ASAP Rocky ever do to make a billion dollars? What the fuck is that nigga ever gonna do to make a billion dollars? What? Rihanna has to is is you, niggas are basically you weirdo niggas are basically saying Rihanna don't deserve no nigga period she don't deserve no nigga period she just supposed to be alone and rich she's so rich that she just supposed to be without a nigga because no nigga can reasonably come in and claim to be running shit if you a man you can be a man and look bummy, be a man and look dusty, be a man and look funky, musty, however you want to look. If you get the job done, if when you come home, you make shit happen, that's what a man is. It ain't looking cute for the cameras. It ain't It ain't being, oh, I'm in the boss position. Yeah, I. it wasn't a cool picture. It wasn't a fly picture. He didn't look good in it, but so the fuck what? Shut the fuck up. I don't know what else to say. ASAP Rocky, I don't know everything about you because you a screen nigga and I don't trust screen niggas. I don't trust anybody who's on a screen. I don't trust any entertainer, anybody who does work that makes them visible to me before I can meet them. Unless you are a, a public servant or something like that. If you're any kind of an entertainer, I don't trust you. I don't want you by me. I don't want you next to me. I don't want you near me because you could be like Janelle Monet. But that's not that's not the issue. ASAP Rocky, you 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 you're a cool dude. You doing what you got to do. You ain't you ain't making no waves. You making your bitch look fly. You making your bitch look good. You making your bitch look like she the, she amazing and she a superstar. That's what you supposed to do. I I approve of that kind of manhood. I'm 33. I don't feel like a man yet. I don't feel like I'm every bit of the man that I could be. But when I look at you, I say, damn, I hope I can find my shorty one day and let her shine like you let your bitch shine. And I can look any kind of way because that's what a man does. And I'm done with y'all. Mass man. Out. <laughs>